So, wine barrel planters. Um, I mean, like, the whole point of wine barrels is to keep liquid inside for a very, very long time. So in order to be effective planters, we need to be able to give them drainage and then uh, set them up so that the drainage themselves won't damage the pot during its life. Two wine barrel planters, a drill, drainage. Nice real big drill bit. Which only have to make a uh, couple of holes. Because the rim is both wood and metal that touches the ground all the way around, also it uh, they're pretty level. I'm going to be putting them up on bricks so that when the water comes down through the holes, it doesn't just puddle up underneath the whole planter and stick there and start rotting the wood. So they're going to be up on bricks. So there we have it, two half wine barrel planters with uh, drainage holes. I'm also going to put gravel and bricks as a bottom layer here to again help improve drainage and to keep the uh, dirt from clogging up the drainage holes. Up on bricks, or I guess you could use pavers or whatever to just get it up so that the bottom of the barrel doesn't touch the water or the ground a lot and doesn't rot faster than you know, I'm like, it's eventually gonna rot its wood, but we can prevent it for as long as possible. Uh, one tip for as far as like choosing oh, where you wanna move these things, d d move them where you want them while they're empty. These things are very, this is solid, solid oak. These things are very heavy. Move them while they're empty, because I don't, I don't think I could move it when it had soil in it. Ugh. Doesn't have to do with barrel planters, but my, uh, my honeysuckle is blooming. Hee <laughs> hee.